Hi everybody, just a quick video about where you can get hold of the vanilla 1.14 files. Well, um, normally just after a release, Behemoth Interactive upload the 1.14 vanilla files for Chernerus and Livonia to their GitHub. So if you look in the description below the video, you'll see um, the link to that GitHub. Um, they don't normally do it exactly on the day. It's normally, normally a few days later. So if you ever need to revert your files back to vanilla and you've got a pc server or you've got a local server on your laptop or your pc this is where you can come to get those vanilla files remember if you've got a console and you've got like a nitrado private server you can just go into the settings and say um, reset xml's to default save and restart and then that will vanillaize all your existing files back to vanilla and then you can untick reset XML to the default, save, and they can upload you your different ones. Very, very useful if you made a mistake or you're not quite sure what's gone wrong and want to start again without doing a complete wipe. Now, to get a hold of the files, to get hold of the XMLs, you click on the little code button where it says download zip, and that will then download that to your local PC. And then you want to copy them to a folder on your computer, and you'll have something that says Daisy Central Economy Master. And if you unzip that or unpack that um, or extract it, you'll then see the ones that we're after. So what you're really interested in are, are the MP mission files. And you've got daisyoffline.chernerus plus for Chernerus and daisyoffline.enoc for Livonia. And if you dig into them, you'll see there's all the familiar XML files, including things like your init.c uh, is in there as well. Um, just remember, though, that... Um, some of these files we don't have access to on console, so init.c for example, and if you muck around with that and upload it to your console server, nothing will happen anyway, because <laughs> it doesn't do anything. Um, and you don't get a, um, a server config .d, uh, dz either, so you're gonna have to make sure you've got one of those if you're trying to do a local server, but you've probably already got that anyway. Um, and there we go. So that, my friends, is how you get hold of the vanilla files for daisy update 1.14 from from bohemia interactive github nice and simple hopefully you find that useful if you have hit like if you want to see more same press subscribe and i will of course see you again soon